Surprise! So here's a video that I wasn't expecting to make at all. It's about decluttering some old emotional garbage. Some of you know that my day job is that I'm a mind-body chiropractor specializing in a thing called the Neuroemotional Technique, or NET. My patients who decided to take on the decluttering challenge had a great time, and somehow the decluttering work felt like a perfect fit to the clinical work. At first, that seemed strange to me. But then I finally realized that on a very basic level, NET basically helps to declutter old traumatic emotional patterns that no longer serve you. A long time ago, they did serve a purpose. They might have even saved your life. But now, they just take up space and energy inside your brain. I'm not going to do an NET demonstration here because it just looks weird, and also you can't do it on yourself anyway but I am going to walk you through a really simple technique that you can do to help yourself declutter some of the noise in your head. It's called FAST, which stands for First Aid Stress Tool. To do FAST, we're going to be using the three pulse points on your wrist that Chinese medicine practitioners use when they're evaluating a patient. They're located here on the thumb side of your wrists, three fingers in a row. Different emotions go with different pulses, but to keep it simple, we're going to hold all of the pulses and do both sides anyway. So you don't have to remember which pulse means what. To do fast, you have to think of something that is stressing you out. Since we're talking about mental and emotional clutter, we'll pick something crappy that takes up a lot of space. A pretty common one is the feeling that you're a great big loser, even if you seem to be holding it together okay on the outside. So go ahead and grab one wrist, pressing three fingers along those pulse points, and then hold your open palm against your forehead. Now you're going to take some slow, deep breaths and just focus on that crappy feeling. Yep, just breathe nice and deep and think about what a big loser you feel like. Just breathe and focus in on that feeling. After about 30 seconds or so, or if it becomes hard to focus on it, go ahead and switch to the other hand and do the same thing. Again, you're holding the Fingers on the three pulse points right below the thumb there. Just wrap around here, that's the easy way to do it. Flat hand on your forehead and breathe nice and deep and just focus on that crappy feeling. Feel the feeling and breathe. What a loser. Nice deep breaths. And that's it. Oddly enough, you probably feel better. And if your particular crappy thoughts tend to land heavily in the realm of shame and feelings of humiliation or worthlessness, then you'll actually want to use this bonus fourth point, which is on the thenar pad of the thumb. You're, you're gonna hold this point with your hand on the forehead and breathe deeply and focus on those crappy feelings of shame and humiliation. Nice deep breaths until they fade away or they're hard to focus on. And then you're gonna do the same thing on the other side, also on that, uh, that point on the thenar pad, base of the thumb. Hold one finger on that point, flat hand on the forehead, breathe nice and deep. Just focus on the, um, and just focus on those crappy shame related feelings. Sometimes you get a better result if you kind of like curl over while you're doing this. Sorry if I blinded you with the shininess of my head when I did that. And that's how you do fast. It's not as amazing as NET, but it's pretty good when you're on your own. You can get a refresher and probably a better video on how to do FAST on the FAST website, which is at firstaidstresstool.com.
And of course, I recommend that you check out a local NET practitioner if you really want to declutter your emotional baggage. You can find a directory of certified practitioners at netmindbody.com. You can also find a documentary about NET right here on YouTube. It's called Stressed. And you can also see a great example of NET in action on Season 15, Episode 22 of Grey's Anatomy. That episode is called Head Over High Heels. And that's my bonus decluttering video. Thanks again for coming along for the ride.